<laughs> Pangagonians may be the masters of imitating other people's accents, but how do we rate others who imitate the Trini accent? Well, more than just doing a fine job at copying our accent, here's one man who did a fine job of reflecting what life in Trinidad and Tobago is all about. This role on the internet website YouTube imitates 1980s action star actor Rudy Bryson, visiting exotic islands and reporting on them, including Trinidad. He talks about the steel drum and carnival and the food, including roti. First thing I had when I was down there was a roti. A roti is like, it's like a sandwich that has curried beef and shrimps and chicken in it. Um, and it's, 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 it's not fried, or well, maybe it is fried, but I'm not too sure, but it's delicious. Now, what I followed that down with was a curry beer. Then doubles while standing in line, he tells in a Trini accent of an interaction he had with a woman. This beautiful woman just came up to me and started talking to me out of nowhere. It's like, I was blown away that she even knew who Woody Brasher was. So you know what she said? She said, Red man, what number play today, boy? The Trini accent comes in again as he speaks about sauce. Sauce is, is like pork and cucumbers and, and, and uh, onions and habanero peppers and it's sort of like a vinaigrette. Delicious. Actually, if you're a big guy and you eat a lot, Trinidadians will say to you, hey, you big sauce. And more food, pilau and kalaloo soup. I also had pilau. Pilau is like a white, uh, a, a brown rice with beef and chicken. All, all that, it's like a stew. And then there's a, there's a kalaloo soup. That's like a spinach soup, but it's softer than spinach. It's got okra and coconut. Oh, man, I'm, I'm, I'm getting so hungry right now. In the end, he gives Trinidad a five star, but what do you give him for his imitation of the Trini accent? Well, as we go, let's bring you the final results of tonight's Your Vote.